In order to fight the world bosses on the map Fyodor, you'll need to collect runestones. You will need to have 30 runestones that you can place in each world boss terminal to spawn them in and fight them. The way to get runestones on this map is by killing alpha creatures. Some alphas will give you a very small amount of runestones while others will give you a massive amount that you can use to activate nearly every boss by only killing one creature. I'm going to be showing you a tier list of all the alpha creatures so you can figure out how to get the most runestones to activate the bosses. It's important to note that the level of the alpha dino also matters. The alpha creature that drops the least amount of runestones is the alpha raptor. A level 5 alpha raptor will only drop one runestone, whereas a level 150 raptor will drop 10 runestones. A step up from the raptor is the alpha kano. Again, it doesn't drop too many runestones. A level 5 drops around 3 runestones, and a max level 150 drops 19 runestones. A step up from the Alpha Kano is the Megalodon, the first of the aquatic alpha creatures. A low level 5 Alpha Megalodon will only drop 7 runestones, whereas a max level 150 will drop 33 runestones. That max level is enough to do one of the world boss fights. The next creature I put on the list was a little bit tricky to know where to place. An alpha leads only spawns at level 1, but every time you kill a level 1 alpha leads it will drop 15 runestones. Alpha leads are actually reasonably easy to kill. This means that you only need to kill two alpha leads to be able to do one of the world boss fights. Next on the list, I placed the alpha rex. A level 5 alpha rex would only drop 9 runestones. However, a max level 150 Alpha Rex will be dropping 39 runestones. The second best creature for getting the runestones is the Alpha Mosa. Located in the terrifying deep ocean trench, Alpha Mosas can be very hard to kill, but they're very rewarding in terms of runestones. A level 5 Mosa will drop 18 runestones. Often you'll need to pick it up from a bag, it won't go into your inventory. And a max level 150 Alpha Mosa will drop 73 runestones. And the biggest and best creature by far for getting runestones is the Alpha Tuso. Again, located in that deep ocean water trench, a level 5 Tuso will drop 26 runestones. And a max level 150 Alpha Tuso will drop a staggering 100 runestones. So if you have the capacity to farm these, I highly recommend doing that. I want to make a note that on the mod version of the map, there was Alpha Carquinos, Alpha Basilisks, and Alpha Wyverns. I haven't yet found them on the official map, but that doesn't mean that they don't exist because these are quite rare alpha spawns. When spawning them in, the Carquinos and the Basilisk were very similar with the Alpha Rexes in terms of how much runestones they dropped. When I spawned in a Fire Wyvern, it did not drop any runestones at all. Hopefully this guide helps you in getting all the runestones you need for the world boss fights. If you're looking for some more tips on the Fjordor map, I have some amazing harvesting guides right here. If this video was helpful, please consider subscribing to the channel. Thank you so much for watching, have a wonderful day.